All right, guys, let's check out the tragic truth by Five Finger Death Punch. Against the wall. Against the wall, boys. What's going on hey. with our boy? Up, I listened to an interview. So I think this is part of, at least symbolic of something that actually happened to him. So I'm really interested to see what that is. And we got some whispers in the background, okay. Oh, he's down in that pretty hard. Alright. Oh, we're going acoustic. Nice. And we got some scary people. Let's go. Okay, that's tragic truth. It's hard for me to understand myself. So it has to be hard as hell for you. For you. Yeah. Are we going to be broken? Yo, this is this is hitting pretty hard. This is I, I like it. I like this more than the, the last one that I reacted to. Um, you know, obviously the, the symbolism in the, the video is just you know, the production is off the charts. This guy, you know, it's obviously some symbolic of the lyrics, you know, the demons that I created for myself. That's what all the scary people with horns are. can't say the devil made me do it I chose to be the one I am the way I am today I wish there was but there's no way around it in the end I made the choice and will not die ashamed it's the boy oh I'm I think this is part of um, what actually happened to him. If you listen to an interview, he talks about something like this. Oh, that's a good solo. Well, he, he's back, and you know, you should go listen to the interview that he talks about this story um, that actually happened to him, because it's really quite powerful and impactful. And I love that, how just how honest and open he's being, like, in his lyrics about, you know, I can't say that the devil made me do it. I've made these choices, and it's on me. And I think that is, 
you know, a really, really powerful thing for someone to say. And it's something that we can actually learn from and say, hey, you know what? Like, uh, you know, like my demons are not my friends, you know, and they're ultimately it's my choice to stand up and fight and make a better life for myself. And I'm glad that, you know, Ivan is being so upfront and honest about his experiences um, with that and making great music about it as well. Um, it's always nice when both when authenticity, authenticity and great music go hand in hand because, you know, it just creates a much deeper meaning around the experience. Can you give me a deep breath, sir? Breathe, buddy. There we go. Sir, do you know your name? Okay, what'd you take, sir? Can you tell me what you took? Lay down. Welcome back. All right. Don't tell the fans. There. Yesterday, I celebrated 42 months of sobriety. And I can honestly say, nice. I never let the darkness settle in. Ever again. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. That almost makes me want to cry, man. Uh, oh, for Pete's sakes. I can't. You, you, I can't read it. But yeah, it's never too late. I agree. It's never too late, guys. You know, you're going through stuff. It's never too late. And. Yeah, and you know this actually, you know, in times like these, yeah, that's the last, that's the next one that I'm reacting to right here. You can check out my other reaction to that. You know, I I don't know what to say. The song speaks for itself. It's amazing. I hope to see you guys over here. And if you're going through something, just hang in there. Hang in there, guys. That's all I can say. <laughs>